From the newsroom at news.com.au. G'day, I'm Andrew Bucklow, and this is the latest from the newsroom. It's Monday the 1st of March. Well, there's been yet another sexual assault allegation against a senior politician. Liberal Senator Sarah Henderson said she received an email from a woman accusing a federal Labor MP of rape. Ms Henderson has passed the email on to the federal police. It comes after a woman accused a minister in the Morrison government of raping her in 1988 before entering Parliament. Overseas now, and Donald Trump is set to make his first public appearance since leaving the White House today. He's set to speak at the Conservative Political Action Conference. He reportedly plans to slam the Republicans who turned on him in his final days of office and could reveal plans for his political future. To sport and legendary commentator Bruce McAvaney has called an end to commentating AFL games. After more than 20,000 matches, he's decided to reduce his workload. Bruce will continue to call the horse racing though and will be a part of the commentary team at the upcoming Olympics if they ever go ahead. To entertainment and Hugh Sheridan has spoken candidly about his new boyfriend and recent brushes with the paparazzi. Speaking to Samantha Armitage on her new podcast, which is called Something to Talk About, Sheridan revealed what it's like to be stalked by the paps. So I saw someone with a long lens on the beach and I said to my friends, like there was a group of us, and I said, do you reckon that's a paparazzi? And they're all like, oh, you're so famous. Like, oh, <laughs> my you're friends pap- do this to me too. And they and go, get over yourself. And then, then the next day, oh, <laughs> next not the minute. next day, it was like four hours oh. later, someone flicks me and I said, oh, you're so famous. <laughs> you're not laughing now, are you, with these hideous photos of you all? <laughs> It's like you got, you're all holding your bellies out. Shocking. <laughs> you can listen to the full interview by searching for something to talk about with Samantha Armitage wherever you get your podcasts. And a reminder, the Golden Globes are on today. Australia has a strong field of contenders, including Kate Blanchett and Nicole Kidman, who are up against each other for the Best Actress in a Limited Series or TV Movie Award. Amy Poehler and Tina Fey are set to host the awards, which are being held virtually this year. And if you'd like to win some money, all you've got to do is have your say in our Cost of Living survey, and you'll be in the chance to win a share of $2,000. You can enter now at news.com.au forward slash win. That's it for this episode of From the Newsroom. I'll be back in the afternoon with another update. Your update from news.com.au.